Hello everyone, in this video I am going to give my review on the Vapid Stainer LE Cruiser with the buy it now price of $4.69 million and with the trade price $3.5 million. You cannot customise this vehicle in Los Santos Customs. You will have to customise it in your own properties like the Arena War Workshop, the Agency and the Auto Shop and so on. Customization on this vehicle. Well, you do get the basic stuff like you do with most vehicles. So, you know, improve the performance, which I recommend. But of course the highlight or one of the highlights here is delivery options. You get at least over 20 livery options and they're all different from each other. If you look carefully on the doors here, it gives like the different locations of the police stations and all that and different numbers as well. So they're all good different amount of options. So that's really good to see. There is police equipment category here. So the first one here in the section of it is the aerials and it has really good amount of options here. If you want to go for the highest tech, go for the tech array 7.0. It'll look crazy on the roof then. And then second one here is the searchlights, which has a good amount of options yet again as well. So that's really good to see on there. And then it has the emergency lighting. So it's depending which one you more like, I guess, but more the better, I think, for this vehicle. That's the three options you can get there, but you cannot completely remove the light bars. Then the final section here is the push bars. So you can have it just with the push bars or with the lights in between it. This vehicle does have the options to respray the primary and the secondary. As you can see, this is where the primary and secondary options would be with the respray. And then the rest of the options is just the normal options you would find on most other vehicles. And if you ever do equip the extra lights, they do work. They do. So they're not there just for decoration, they actually will be useful. So we're going to check inside the vehicle, but at the back here in the trunk, it has some armor, guns, ammo, gas grenades, stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. Then we're going to have a look at the back seats here where you take the people that are arrested. But of course, there's nothing really much going on as expected. But at the driver's seat here, it has the laptop, like the radio, and it has some guns there in between the seats there at the front. And it looks like the combat shotgun that you can unlock and buy in GTA 5 Online. And then the engine, it just looks like a normal engine, nothing special really. Just so you know, the emergency lights do work. You can turn them on and off if you like. Performance on this vehicle. The handling is good, I would say. It's nothing amazing. Maybe if you put it to medium or low speeds, then it should handle really well, I would say. But with the downside though with it is the brakes. The brakes could be better in my opinion. Even without the upgrades, it could be a lot worse to be honest. It's not, not great, but it's not like unusable bad brakes. The brakes are, I would say, nearly bad. It's not great. It's not terrible, I would say. But if you're going to turn a corner and need to brake, make sure you brake way beforehand. The top speed, which is decent, I would say, which the top speed it can go up to is 102.75 miles per hour. It does even just break over that 100 miles per hour a little bit. Overall, I'd say it's a good performance vehicle. It's fine. So I think the vehicle is maybe worth buying when it's at trade price, which is $3.5 million, but I don't know about $4.6 million. I think if unless you're like a huge fan collecting police vehicles and stuff like that, then maybe 4.6 could be worth it for you. If you're not really a big fan, I don't see why you need to pay that much to be honest. But if you can though, try and get it in trade price either way. It is a nice vehicle to drive around. But that's how I look at it in my opinion. Thank you for watching this video everyone.